Tell us what happened as a function of this trial. They were found guilty. Yes, both of them. He got a hundred and some years, and I think she got 70 some years. How did you feel when they were finally held accountable? It wasn't a happy day. It wasn't. Um, I still felt like I had broke the family up. The kids didn't have parents anymore, and they were scattered to the wind, and so was I. Uh, I felt like I lost my entire family just in one swoop. This detective, Debbie, um, you, you, you bonded with her early on, and she helped you a lot in the early going, right? Right. And there was a time when uh, y you were having a really, really difficult time, and uh, they thought that you might not be stable, and there was consideration of putting your daughter in foster care because you were struggling, right? Right. And Debbie stepped in and said she can stay with me instead of going to foster care. Let's hear what Detective Debbie has to say about Elsa's case. This was my first case of child abuse that I'd ever worked because I was a brand new detective. When I first saw Elsa, she looked like she was about 12 years old. She looked like she weighed about 80 pounds. She was just covered in scars from the top of her head all the way to her toes. Every time Mr. and Mrs. Combs came in for a visit, Elsa's blood pressure would go up and she would start shaking. Every time that they would examine Elsa, they would find Mr. Combs hiding behind the curtain. I knew that they were hiding something. I asked her, how did you get this scar? She says, I didn't know I had any scars. Elsa left the hospital and went home with the Combses. I started setting up surveillance where they lived. I never saw her. I thought, maybe they have killed her. Several months later, I got a telephone call, and she said, I want to tell you everything that has happened to me since I was a little girl. The torturous things that they did to her were unspeakable. This is absolutely the worst case that I've seen in my career. When a child's murdered, there's an end. This was a pattern and ruined her life. She played a big role in getting this turned. Yes, she did. Right? Yes, she did. And right now, the, the, the challenge that you face, and one of the things that, that you want me to help you with, is to get your life back on track, to overcome the anxiety that just haunts you. Except for my daughter, I have broken relationships everywhere. You've made one right decision because I'm going to help you get out of this. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.